everybody. <clears throat> Nancy here. Oh, clear my voice. Clear my throat. Nancy here from Fancy Nancy Diamond Painting. Trying to get my scissors. I got a lot of uh, China mail lately, which makes me happy. I think it's funny, I had this running through my head. I just went and picked something up out of my mailbox. And I'm thinking, you know, these things are shipped all the way from China. And they come to us here in the United States and they pass through many hands and many machines. And then they get here all the way to this tiny town in Southern Illinois and the mailman crams it into the post off into the mailbox so i don't know this is a um it's a full drill but it's uh, it's got the clear cover and uh you can see they folded it to fit into the envelope which it's fine. If they had folded it like halfway through and folded it, that would be miserable. But they folded it here on the end, which I understand. But you know what? Buy a bigger envelope. Is that so hard? <laughs> um, if you hear me say something that, that sounds remotely mean, I'm joking. My mother and I have a joke because we have the same very uh, sarcastic, cynical kind of sense of humor. And I think once she said something and a friend got upset with her and she said, oh, but I didn't mean it. I was kidding. And her friend said, if you didn't mean it, why did you say it? So we joke about that a lot. If one of us says something that's a little a little mean or off, you know, off color, not the kindest thing, then we both say to each other, if you didn't mean it, why did you say it? Uh, some people don't get us. But we get us, so it's okay. Um, this is a standard kit pink pen with a single drill tip, green boat. I was laughing because one of the other videos I said a blue boat and I just kept going and I didn't even notice I said the wrong thing until I listened to the video again. And uh, that's what my brain does. It just substitutes words that are wrong. Pink wax bags, very standard. That is perfectly acceptable. So this is a uh, sunflower. Now this is interesting because I know this couldn't have cost more than eight bucks. It, it was um, not an expensive one, but it's it's beautiful. Um, there's here. Let me show. There's a lot of shading in there. Um, it has eighteen colors clear symbols they're very clear i'll put the image up for you there's this is wonderful i mean this is a nice size you could take it on the road with you in a little tote bag it's a 30 by 40 um, here are the drills, and I can tell right away. Look at that yellow. I mean, sunflowers, cheery. I see a, a pale blue from the sky up here. It's not super detailed, but it's going to be a nice diamond painting. I think it's going to look pretty, and it would be one that I would f not frame it, but put it on a painted, stretched canvas, which is super fun. And um, I even saw in my group, my friend Lisa posted a couple where she put them on stretch canvas and 
she painted the canvas to match the image like down here where it's green she painted that part of the canvas green and the sky she painted blue it was it was really neat the way the color matched the diamond painting and I like that so much that I'm going to try that next time. Um, there's not a lot of color, so I can go through. These are just, uh, the bags are numbered. So, one, there's no DMC numbers. Maybe someday my chart will come in. If not, I'll, I just throw my spare ones where I don't have a DMC number into a big um, container that is displayed. Of course, I, I can't find the numbers I want. Let's see. 7, 9, 4, 14, 8, 5. I always think this should be super fast, and it just never is. 2. Oh, see, look how pretty. Look at this, like a pale sky blue and then an aqua kind of blue. I don't know if you can tell, but I love colors. I love them. I love thinking about if they're too light or too dark. Three. I like thinking of fun names for them. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I love that one. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Okay, everything's here. So you know, some people say they don't like the smaller size. Um, they hate this plastic. That's fine. You don't like it, don't get it. Now you know, this one has the plastic cover. And it's, it's not huge. And it's not fancy. But it's nice. It, it, I like it. I enjoy these, these colors. I think this will be a fun one to do. Um, and, uh, yeah. So, you know, there's something for everybody. I, I don't turn my nose up at anything. Some of the cheapest diamond painting kits wind up being the most beautiful. I'll put the link in the description for you if you want to check it out. And, um, thanks again for, for tuning in. I'll be back with more diamond paintings very soon. If you um, like this video, go hit the thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, um, hit the little bell if you want to be notified when I put up new videos, and uh, come join us on Facebook. We're having a little contest to see who, which diamond painting picture is going to be the cover page. So come join us. Show us your stuff. We want to see what you're working on. Have a great day. Bye-bye.